Hey, what's going on, guys? My name is Frost, and today I'm going to be bringing you guys another edition of Two Heads Are Better Than One. And today I'm back here with another guest. Introduce yourself, man. Uh, hey, what's up, guys? My name is B. Hoover's here, and uh, I'm just another Call of Duty commentator like Elemental Frost here. Uh, yeah, we pretty much uh, we met through actually your live stream, didn't we? Yeah, that was that was cool. You came and we hung out for a little bit in my live stream, played some Modern for three for a little bit. And... Yeah, and then you switched over. I think it was to. Uh... Oh, what's that game? What's that game called? I completely, my mind Minecraft, just threw a blank. I think. Minecraft. Yeah, probably. Um, but anyway, yeah. So he's just gonna do pretty much a channel intro to what he does on his channel. So if you want to continue with that, that'd be cool. <clears throat> All right. So uh, basically, what I do on my channel is I post, you know, I post commentaries about life stories sometimes, different. If I have a tip or two, I'm gonna throw it in there every once in a while. But mostly, I don't do tip videos. Uh, I do Minecraft videos, mostly live commentaries, and then I actually have done a couple server series that I have done uh, on different servers, so if you guys want to play with me, that's fine, I'll just, I think there's a video on my channel that I'll, um, if you want to come over and like tweet at me or something like that, it's just on my channel and you can just tweet at me about the server, but, um, and then I post, like I'll post like different games, like NBA games or, you know, like Black Flag Retribution, I'm just a very variety based channel, I love playing a lot of different games. But uh, mostly I just play Call of Duty and I just post that. I mean, I just do random topics on what I feel like I need to talk about, so yeah. Yeah, I, I usually do that too, like, you know, just random topics. And uh, actually, I just finished a topic about how I'm actually going to get uh, partnered with Yoush. That's going to be up, uh, I think I think that was up yesterday, guys. So go check that out if, you wanna, in, or if you're interested in how I'm going to get partnered with Yoush. Go check that out, it's pretty cool. And, uh... Yeah, so the gameplay you're watching right now, uh, it's not really an amazing gameplay. Uh, well, I guess it's it's a cool gameplay, but it's not like an amazing score or anything. But I don't really care what I post for scores. I just post gameplay, and I try to focus my channel on uh, you know commentary. You try to do that too? Yeah, I'm not a best. I'm not the best gameplay uh, provider. I don't. I don't go for you know basically like 60 plus TDM or 60 kill TDMs or you know like really high score Moabs or anything like that. Like that. If I get a good yeah. score, I'm gonna post it. Like I think 35 and two is a good score and TDM or like a 45 domination is fine to me. But most yeah, of the yeah. time, I don't base it off score, just commentary. Yeah, me too. But uh, actually, now that you bring up Moabs, I kind of want to hit on some if you don't mind. Oh, that's um, cool. Pretty much what I'm thinking is like there's a lot of channels out there. And we're not going to point any out like specifically. They base their uh, you know they base their channel off of just Moabs. Okay, what what is your opinion when Black Ops 2 is going to come out? What's going to happen to their channel then? Well, I think they're either going to keep posting either Modern for three or Modern for two, or they're going to have to find something else that they're going to post. Um, mostly what I think that they're going to do is probably just post, you know, like really high scoring gameplay with like 100 pluses and stuff like that with different guns. I think that's how they're going to, you know, evolve their, their channel. channel. Yeah. So yeah. I, I don't think they're as, at as much of a disadvantage as some of these other guys, but I think that with all the Black Ops 2 in, innovation that they're bringing, that there are going to be a lot of uprising Call of Duty commentators that um, maybe this is a niche for some of the smaller guys to, uh, you know, blow up her channels with something new, but I don't know. I, I don't really think that they'll be damaged from Black Ops 2. I just don't think they won't be as entertaining as they used to be with their, you know, Penta and Quad Moabs, jeez. <laughs> Penta or whatever, Jay Nasty, you know? Yeah. But, uh, yeah, there's actually a point in my career, I don't know if you, uh, I don't know if you've seen my videos back then, but there was a point in my YouTube career when I focused my channel on Moabs 2, and I did that for about a good month and a half, and then I just, uh, you know, I just stopped doing that because I just found absolutely no originality in it whatsoever because, I mean, you just go on the YouTube search bar, you search up Moabs, and you find, like, you know, some, like, 9,000 channels or something, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's it's not very really an original topic, and, uh, yeah, there's just a, people, a couple people out there that do focus their channels on Moabs, and uh, I pretty much think what Behoover is actually thinking, like, what's going to happen to them when Black Ops 2 comes out? Uh, it's either all those things that he listed, or their channel's just gonna die slowly. Yeah, yeah. I, I don't. I, don't, I think people like Jay Nasty and Green Goblin will uh, stay up, but I don't know if people like I'm Gifted or you know Mr. Exquisite X B L will stay uh, posting Black Ops too. It just depends on what they want to post. I mean, they might go to a variety-based channel. I don't know, but. Um, <laughs> 
with the upcoming game, I'm very excited for Black Ops 2. I can't wait. I'm kind of. I, I don't know how I feel about them. Not did they put in a nuke or a Moab in Black Ops? I don't think they did. But I'm honestly not sure. I mean, there was speculation about it before because uh, you know David Vonderhaar he tweeted uh, the nuke emblems emblems or whatever. Yeah. He tweeted that, and I think he was just pretty much hitting on the fact that Nuketown 25 20, or 2025 is coming back. Oh, I think a lot of people took that as a nuke. All right. Yeah. Well, I don't know. How do you feel about a nuke not being in the game or Moab or whatever? Um, I, I guess not. You know, not having a nuke in the game that would just it would kind of go back to the fact, uh, like you know, Black Ops and you know, World at War, everything before Modern Warfare Two and stuff. I think it would just go back. Uh, I don't think it would go back to the originality of where uh, you know Call of Duty actually started, like you know, COD Four. Like there was only three kill streaks. Uh, it wasn't. It was just basic. wasn't uh, you know customizable, but you can still customize everything like that in uh, Black Ops 2. And uh, I'll probably hit on the uh, the create a class system, like the new point system here in a little bit, probably in the next commentary or something. Uh, let you guys know about that. You probably guys already know about that, but uh, yeah. Yeah, that this game looks. This, this new Call of Duty looks very innovative. I'm really excited for it. Um, but I don't really think, I'm, I don't know if I'm ex- kind of sad or happy that the Moab's gone, because it, it gives a little bit of a, uh, incentive to go for gameplays, but, you know, then again, you know, it's just, and that also kind of ruins the game, because everybody gets bored of it real fast, but I think yeah. that was kind of really all I wanted to talk with you about for, you know, Black Ops 2 and Marvel 3 Moab and stuff like that, so. Yeah, yeah. Alright, uh, well, we're coming down to a close here. The gameplay is actually, uh, it's probably over now. So, uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this dual com with B Hoovers. Um, yeah, go check out his channel. Annotation is on the screen the entire time. And uh, also a link in the description below. Alright, thanks, man. Yeah, no problem. Alright, guys, I will talk to you guys later. Go check him out, show him some love, and uh, that's pretty much it. Peace. See you guys.